So I remember when I was a kid and I used to daydream a lot. I remember in school I'd get in trouble for, you know, not having my work on time because I would spend so much time just thinking, why isn't the wall blue? Or why doesn't the tree have arms? Or, you know, I would question the world a lot. And I guess I still do. Nowadays I can say, I can daydream and I can create an idea out of absolutely nothing. Hey, my name's Jack. I'm a student graph designer studying in Falmouth, which is like a small seaside town down in Cornwall, which I find really benefits my work. I always like getting out and getting inspired, taking photographs, drawing pictures, writing things down. Everything is a possible inspiration, which is why when you look at my Instagram you see little weird pictures of street signs and traffic codes. I think you find the best ideas in the strangest places. I guess my area of work is usually type design or illustration. I've created a number of typefaces which are being used out in the real world, which is amazing to see. And illustration is great because it's the one area of design which doesn't have any rules. And it allows for so much creative freedom. So last summer, I took on this challenge where I had to design something new every single day for 100 days. And this really changed the way I approached my work. It showed me for just one question, there could be a million different answers. So yeah, I'm not quite sure what I'll be designing next, but I know I'll be enjoying it. My name is Swerve and I'm a graphic designer slash YouTuber. I like to create designs in a couple different ways and sometimes being at home drives me crazy. I found it really fun going out to places like London and Brixton to find different textures and looking at buildings and the way the shape of it is and incorporating that into a design that I could call a masterpiece. I guess the way I find most of my ideas is through music. When I listen to some music, I get a feel. And when I feel it, I know that I can convert that feeling into a, you know, an idea, a visual. I can listen to Alessia Cara and think to myself, all right, here we go. In my mind, I'm thinking of clouds, white, blue, different colors come to my mind and textures and I can just use those ideas to create a beautiful design. I would say I'm a big fan of strong line work, but for this project I tried to move away from strong line work and, you know, test out some thin line work so I can express more of the colour more than just the line work of the design. <laughs> 